hello you're welcome to my channel so today we'll be talking on cut care umbilical cut care as a first time mom you mostly get different advice from mothers around you especially mothers who have already put to bed who have children already and from non-health personnel and sometimes you get confused on which advice to take concerning this topic so on this channel on this uh, video you are going to learn on the, how to take care of your baby's cord don't forget to subscribe to like and to press the notification bell for more important for more important topics like this so what is the umbilical cord the umbilical cord is a flexible tube-like structure that has a spongy appearance. It, must, it connects your baby to the placenta. I know there are different names you call you call it in different languages, but it's the um, baby's um, is called the umbilical cord. The, it has two arteries and a vein that connects to the placenta. During birth, the midwife cuts the placenta with part of the cut, and the storm is left for you to take care of as the mother. So, how do you care for the umbilical cord? Firstly, you arrange your materials, collect your materials, especially materials for baby's bath. Make sure you prepare materials before starting your baby's bath so that you not leave the baby unattended while trying to get the material you forgot to put put a warm face uh, face towel and it might baby soap make sure you don't use different baby cleansing soaps you use your my baby soap that suits your baby and as a mom you know which um, baby soap suits your baby best after you've arranged your materials, wash your hands with soap and water. Before do, touching a baby or doing anything with the baby, always wash your hands with soap and water properly. After washing your hands, clean the baby's cord, base of the cord with a warm, damp face towel. If this make sure you keep the rest of the cord dry do not wet the cord always keep it dry and use a warm damp face towel to clean the base of the cord you can dilute your my cleanser in water and use your cotton swab to clean or remove any dead feces or urine around the stone Pat dry with a dry towel. Make sure you do, you do not rub. Just pat dry. Before you were told alcohol is used to clean the cord, but now alcohol is no longer used. This is because alcohol firstly provokes bleeding and secondly it irritates the skin and this can delay healing. So when are you supposed to see a doctor? Firstly, if your baby's thumb has not fallen after three weeks of age, then it's good to see a doctor. Secondly, if you notice any signs of infection, which are posts around the area or posts in the storm, swelling around the storm, make sure you report to the, the baby's provi healthcare provider. A baby's umbilical cord storm looks like this if it is healing properly you should avoid do, doing these things to keep your baby's cut um, healthy firstly don't use different cleansing creams on your baby's cut secondly don't keep the area wet and thirdly don't forcefully pull off the storm allow it to fall off on its own Fourthly, don't put baby's diaper above the cord. Always fold it down below the cord. Thanks for watching. Don't